Hey guys, this is Ganesh. Welcome back to Ganesh Jada Automation Studio. So today, basically, we are going to talk about the, one of the issues uh, which is exist in IntelliJ IDEA. Like whenever we are trying to run our test cases, sometimes we will get a message like error Java error release version five not supported. So this kind of error basically uh, we are getting now. Here you can see uh, on my screen basically we are where you can see this error. Now why this error is occurring? Like what is the main reasons behind it? So guys, sometimes what happen like whenever we are trying to change uh, change anything in a pom.xml file, so that time this kind of issue is occurring basically, guys. Okay, uh, like whenever we are trying to add a new dependency or we are trying to remove some existing dependency, so that time this message we are getting. So this is nothing but guys, what we we must need to compatible with compatible our project with an uh, latest Java version. So right now the by default set the versions of the five. And we need to upgrade. So how to upgrade this term? Simple. You have to. So there are there are two things, two steps basically we have to follow. The first step, guys, you have to click on the file options. You have to click on the setting option. Then you have to click on where, guys, here build, execution, and deployment. You have to just navigate this term. Then you have to navigate this compiler option. And once you navigate, you need to click on the Java compiler option. Once you are clicking on the Java compiler options, you have to uh, what, guys? You have to select. Now I'm using the Java 11 version, so I'm I'm just selecting the targeting bytecode version here 11, and I'm just need to click on apply button and OK button. Once this is done, this is the first thing, and second step you have to perform again. You have to click on the file option. You have to go to you have to click on this project structure. Then you have to click on this model option. Make sure you are on the source option basically, and once this is done, you have to set this language level. So here you can see guys by default it is set over here five enum keyword and what exactly I'm trying to do simple you need to navigate and here again I need to select 11 like I'm using the Java 11 version so that is why I'm selecting the 11 like if you are uh, using 10 uh, Java 10 versions you are using Java 12 versions you are using so you have to select respect to those versions so here I'm just selecting this local syntax for lambda expression 11 that's it and again I'm here clicking on this apply button and OK button. Once this is done, here you can see, guys. Now again, I'm trying to run my scripts, and here you can see, guys, my script is going to run successfully over here. So these are the two steps basically we have to follow over here, guys. And you can see, guys, my, my scripts are again uh, like uh, properly running. Okay. So this is the thing basically I want to tell you guys uh, uh, in this video. That's it for today.